So when it comes to the God of War TV series, it looks like the project is an absolute mess. We've had writers being fired. It looks like they're going back to the drawing board. And we have a whole article here kind of going into the details, breaking down what's happening. And um, like I said, it looks like it's a bit of a mess. So let's jump into this article. Let's take a look at these details. Let's see what's going on with the God of War show. This has been one of my most anticipated projects of the next few years. I mean, a God of War TV show. I mean, that would be absolutely incredible. The games are phenomenal. And if they can capture some of that magic from the games and put it into a tv show sign me up take my money so let's jump in here this comes to us from cosmic book news god of war showrunner writers fired series getting overhauled well i mean the thing is when you're adapting a ip of such a magnitude like god of war you have to make sure you do it right because if you do it wrong if you come out with like a borderlands type movie and obviously we know what happened with borderlands that movie came out flopped on its face made no money it was such a bad movie it's tainted the ip of borderlands and what they don't want to do is end up making a really really bad series and end up tainting the kind of reputation of the god of war series of the video game and uh, obviously losing out on sales in future god of war games so they have to get it right they have to do a good job here and um, people are expecting a lot from this project, you know, because the material is such such a great uh, piece of material when it comes to video games. So um, people's expectations are sky high for this God of War series. So it's learned that God of War series in development at Amazon for Sony Pictures TV is getting a complete overhaul and that the showrunner and writers have been fired. Again, you know, this is, this is horrible to hear. You never want to hear of a project doing this bad and being failed. They've probably spent a lot of money on this, but I would rather they go back to the drawing board and rehire new writers and get the project right rather than just going ahead with it and putting out a mediocre subpar um, piece of content. So it's kind of great that this has happened, but at the same time, it's not. I would rather they did go back to the drawing board and get it right, but at the same time, it's never nice to see a, a project of this magnitude kind of struggling. So the live action God of War was announced back in 2022, with word of writing on the series was underway back in January of this year. However, now it's reported that due to wanting to go in a different creative direction, showrunner uh, Rafe Judkins and his executive producers and writers Hawk Odsby and Mark Fergus have been let go. So whatever's been going on, they want to go in a different creative direction. It seems like the path that they were going down with this project, the exec the executives they weren't happy with what they were seeing how it was developing how it was progressing it just wasn't turning out the way they wanted so they decided to scrap it i have no idea how much money they've spent on this already the, bu the budget could potentially balloon because of this but it is what it is so deadlines say multiple scripts were completed for the first season but that the studios are looking to move in a different creative direction the site adds that Sony and Amazon now plan to hire a whole new writer's room for the God of War series, which is an important asset for Prime Video. The fact that the entire writer's room here has been fired, has there been some like really bad blood going on behind the scenes? You know, have there been arguments? Have there been kind of a falling out between the writers, the executives? And, um, you know, it sounds really bad to fire all of the writers and go back to square one. It sounds like there was some sort of chaos behind the scenes. Whether that's going to come out in the next few weeks, we're going to hear about what actually happened. Um, because, yeah, they say they're going in a different creative direction, but to fire every single writer, um, it sounds like there's more to the story here than what we're, you know, what we're kind of, um, what we're kind of learning. So, interestingly enough, uh, Rafe Judkins is behind Amazon and Sony's Wheel of Time, which I don't think has been all that well received. Yeah, it, it didn't land the way they wanted it to. I couldn't watch more than the first episode. Uh, removing the entire creative team is also similar to what Marvel Studios recently did with Daredevil Born Again series. I was told that Daredevil Born Again was a complete disaster and would be getting retooled, which uh, the trades exactly said months later. I'm guessing it's something similar with God of War. I'm also guessing, and uh, let's cross our fingers, that Amazon have learned that from the rings of power not to fuck up beloved ips if done right god of war could be huge it's not hard to get right um that statement there i really don't agree with that whatsoever it's not hard to get right i mean we're talking about this kind of story that's bigger than life itself you know you have kratos you have all these kind of deities and gods and this fantasy and all this fiction and this kind of this kind of lived in fantasy fantasy world and you've got kratos's son and you know his backstory and there's a lot of stuff here to cram into a series to get right and to adapt it from a video game into a series it's going to be really really hard i mean they've struggled with lord of the rings to adapt it into a series and uh they've got the best some of the best writers and directors in the world working on that and they've struggled with it so it's not the easiest thing to get right um but like it says here um 
you know, they don't want to they don't want to fuck up this beloved IP because it's going to have a knock on effect to the reputation of God of War. Like I was saying, not just the series or any potentially movies, potential movies, but the actual games themselves. You know, people when when they bring out another God of War game in the future, they're going to think, oh, it's, it's, it's God of War. You know, it's that crappy TV show that came out and then it might put people off buying the games. And, um, you know, they're going to lose out on sales and then um, ultimately the franchise will fail. And hopefully that doesn't happen. I'm also wondering if the change in creative direction has to do with setting and the version of Kratos they want to go with. Will it be younger Greek storyline or the recent older version of Kratos with his son? I'm hoping for the former. Personally, I would rather them go with the older Kratos with his son because that's what I'm used to. I've played the newer games more than what I played the older games. So the newer games are kind of um, more stuck in my mind. And I prefer that kind of older grizzled kind of Kratos with his son. That dynamic between father and son, him looking after his son. And then ultimately, he's a very stoic character. But we slowly see him becoming more emotionally attached to his son. You know, growing closer to his son, that bond forming in the, in the games. And to see that play out on screen um in a tv show i think would be really really compelling but yeah guys so that's kind of where we are at the moment so it looks like they've basically fired um they've basically fired all of the writers room um and they've just gone back to square one with this like i say on the one hand it's horrible to hear that this has happened um because obviously the budget is going to balloon it's going to take them a lot longer to bring this show out we're going to have to wait longer but at the same time it's such a beloved ip in the video game industry to translate this to a series similar to what they did with fallout similar to what they've done with L the last of us to get this right it could absolutely explode and be one of the best tv shows ever made so let's hope they can get it right. Let's hope they can make something really special here, um, like Fallout, like The Last of Us, and do it really, really well, because people would love to see this, but expectations are ho uh, sky high, so they have to raise the bar. They have to do a good job with this, and um, let's hope that they do, um, because I would love to see this series come out and basically, you know, do fantastic, like those other video game adaptations we talked about. So guys, you hear this story. Does it have you concerned and worried for the series? Are you still excited to see a God of War series or has this kind of you know dampened your expectations has this kind of dampened your excitement for the show coming out in the future whatever your thoughts are pop them down in the comment section guys leave your thoughts comments and opinions can't wait to hear what you have to say about this story thanks so much for watching be sure to hit that like and subscribe before you leave and I will see you in the next video